Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is an Adobe Premiere Pro. I am going to simplify aspect ratio for you and show you how to find the aspect ratio of any two dimensions. So the most common video size that you're probably familiar with right now is 1920 by 1080 or 1080p. That's what you typically see on YouTube. And that has an aspect ratio of 16 by nine. So you might hear 16, nine a lot. That is referring to the aspect ratio. Now the aspect ratio is nothing more than the relationship or the ratio of width to height of any image or any video, okay? So it doesn't really matter what the pixel size is, 1920 by 1080, it matters about the relationship of width to height. So the first number in the aspect ratio is always gonna be the width, and the second number is always gonna be the height. So if you glance at an aspect ratio, such as 16 by nine, which is one of the most common you're gonna be dealing with, the 16 is the width, and the nine is the height. Therefore, because the 16 is bigger than the height or the width is bigger than the height, you know it's gonna be a horizontal image, right? If you switch them and go nine by 16, that means that the nine is smaller than the height of 16. So that's gonna be a vertical image such as what you would post to Instagram stories, all right? So to find the aspect ratio for any pixel dimensions inside of Premiere Pro, all you need to do is create a new sequence by going to file, New sequence or command N is the shortcut. Go to settings here in the middle and right here. This is the frame size. Whatever you put into these two fields, the horizontal is also the same as width. The vertical is also the same as height. Whatever you put into these two fields, Premiere Pro will automatically generate the correct aspect ratio right here. So we know that 1920 by 1080 is 16 by nine. If we flip these around and put in 1080, by 1920, which is the correct size for a video of Instagram stories, when I hit tab, boom, nine by 16. No matter what you put in here, it's gonna automatically generate. So if I type in 2048 by 1536, which is an iPad size, hit tab, four by three, that is the aspect ratio in Premiere Pro. Just type in the number and you can always check to see that you have the correct aspect ratio. Cheers. Extra credit bonus. So now that we know what aspect ratio is, width to height. If I were to type in 1920 by 1920, what do you think that the aspect ratio is gonna be? Remember, it's width to height. If they are exactly the same, what do you think the aspect ratio is gonna be? That's right, one to one. That is what a square is. It doesn't matter what they are. If these two numbers are the same, the aspect ratio will always be one to one, and you know that is a square. Cheers.